was the first time I'd ever had a go at production or recording just in my room. I just put it on SoundCloud because I had family abroad and I wanted to show them like, oh, hi, Uncle Carl, like here's some music that I've done or whatever. And then, you know, I'd go away to do my studies and a few months later, it's like, oh, <laughs> people are listening to this. It's really odd. So I just carried on doing what I was doing and then slowly built up this fan base from not really doing any PR or anything, just purely from people who are interested, they'll re share it or whatever. So it's quite natural and an amazing way to get into the industry, I think. You make this music in your room alone and obviously they're about very serious things and other people are listening to it in their room and like other people can maybe relate to certain things. It's 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 very weird, you just gotta remember that you're not making the music for them, you're making it for yourself. And once you lose that, that's when you start to kind of go off track because I didn't want to have this career as a career, I would never think about whether it was for anyone else. I never saw it as like a feasible option. Um, it wasn't something, it's not like a lot of people who are musicians would be able to like have a, I don't know, paying rent and stuff like that. Like, unless you're at the top level, it's very difficult to sustain it and to have things like tour support. Yeah, I was always gonna go down a different route and this was kind of a last minute thing when labels are like, do you know what, you could probably have a career in this if you, if you gave, gave it a shot. And I was like, are you joking? And then just on a whim, just said, yeah, I'll do it for a year. Let's just see how it goes. <laughs> I don't know, I feel like I probably should have put more work into it. I've, I put everything, I don't know, because so many people have gone to like these music production schools for years and years and they've, they've, all, they've wanted this the whole entire life. And part of me feels like I've kind of cheated that a bit because I don't, I don't necessarily, I'm not grade eight on, piano and I don't know a lot about production but I do what I do so yeah